Hello, it's Sarah. I had a busy painting day yesterday. Um, so, in the previous video, I shared how I applied the pattern with this Sorel paper. And I didn't realize that. You had it out? Yeah. Okay, bye. Um, that it comes off when you float. So I, I started inking. I mean, I started painting because my pen, and I ordered another one, the Rapidograph. That'll be here today, and I'll share when it comes. But I just wanted to tell you that there's a reason <laughs> she wants the ink first. Because if you paint, all these blue lines come right off. So I'm in the process of reapplying the lines that I lost, which is just mainly the words. I was able to ink pretty much everything else. I keep saying ink paint so float or wash I'm so excited about this piece though because it's so different from what I normally do which is this so when that happened I went ahead and I did these two yesterday which I'll share with you so these are the, the two of the plum purdy pieces um, from the Easter tiered bundle um, and I did my gold leafing on the edges some of the stuff I tried to paint down in the nooks and crannies uh, that I knew I wouldn't be able to reach with my gold leafing pen but they're so cute these are so easy and I didn't have the stencils this these dots the bigger dots were a stencil evidently and I just did a wash and painted them I mean you can even see the pencil lines like I drew a pencil line but it doesn't look bad it's fine they're so cute and happy um, yeah these uh, I they're washes but they're kind of lumpy and bumpy but I don't care it's an Easter egg guy and he's so cute um, so yeah so I, I managed to do the, and I don't have all the colors that she has so I just pick something similar and guess what like here's the picture different colors. see how this is a little more teal and this is a little more blue um, what else pretty much everything else is pretty good um, I didn't have the same pink but boy it's close mine's a little more coral a little more orangey and that's a little more pink but it looks cute without that next to it you don't even notice so anyhow but just for today I'm going to reapply the lettering and I'm gonna work with this pen this is called doesn't even have the full name on it wait a minute I want to say it's a Molotov like uh, what's sticking in my head is like a Molotov cocktail but that it's called the black liner and it's a 0.05 and I got this here it is Moloto M-O-L-O-T-O-W um, black liner it's permanent ink it's water-based indelible made in Germany 0.05 millimeter um, so I'm gonna be inking this one because I think I'm gonna do another one it's just so cute anyway and it's and it's fun um, all I have to do is get it base coated and then the rest is pretty much it's simple okay so that's what I wanted to tell you so I am reapplying the words because that's really all I need to do. And the line across. So I'm going to use a ruler. Anyway. Alright you guys. That's it. Thanks for watching.